Wrestling ill needs a villain such as you. Enough talk, have at you! Oh yes, I remember now, the, the inexplicably turn-based RPG wrestling game. Yes. Which, apparently, like the entirety of Will Fight for Food, contains no actual wrestling. Pretty much, yeah. Absolutely ridiculous. And don't even bother with magic, it'll just kill you. I found that one out the hard way. And if you don't act fast enough, you automatically lose. Hmm. So this is an ATV sort of engine. Except more failure. Okay, I did it, I won. Thank you. Oh, good thing I saved my game. <laughs> Sports, and we go live to the Wrestle Zone for a press conference. Thank you, everyone, for coming. I'd like to introduce you to the Wrestle Zone's latest champion, Surly Joe. I don't know how, but he has the belt, which is good enough for me. Thank you, Donald. You can imagine it wasn't difficult to take the belt from Brain. <laughs> <coughs> And now, as the new champion, I challenge you, O'Sullivan, to a no-holds-barred last-man-standing match for ownership of the Wrestle Zone. No way is O'Sullivan stupid enough to accept. Well, gosh darn it, I accept. <laughs> what a wonderfully Wait timed a flush. <laughs> this ain't good. Surly's not content to have Smiley out. He wants to take over the Wrestle Zone. And you can be sure we won't last five minutes with him in charge. And in this poor economic climate, we'd be on the front line of the recession. Oh. It's always just a big joke to you, ain't it? Huh? No, really. We spend the whole night running around for you, putting ourselves in danger. And when it can't get any worse, all you can do is crack wise-ass remarks. Uh-oh. Oh, you're getting it now. I don't know, that sounded like a perfectly legitimate oh, concern to me. Face. Simon. That'll shut him up for a while. Not a word. It is legitimate. What the crayons? Looks like Brain's been drawing again. What? Brain... Ah. My friend, are you? He hit me in the face. Let me see. Close the door. Oh, that face. Yeah, what did he think I meant? Never mind. It looks like Simon took his frustration out on Brain's poster. There's a fist-shaped dent right in the middle of it. Maybe I can patch this poster up. I'm sure we've got some art supplies somewhere. Let me take a look. Actually, I forgot to pick up the crayons. Sorry! No, it's not exactly a lengthy backtrack. And here is where we get the brilliant idea which solves all of our problems. I think I might be getting an idea. I'm sorry, my friend, but bear with me one moment. Uh, let's see. Facial hair. None. That looks kind of familiar. Back. Hair. Ponytail. Where have I seen that before? 
do you know where I'm going here? Not entirely. Standing back for a moment, I came to a sudden revelation. With a little help, Brain could pass as Mr. O'Sullivan. Oh, now it's even worse! Sorry about that, my friend, but I've got a plan. Clarice, hi. I take it you heard the news about O'Sullivan. I was hoping you might have an idea. Perfect timing. So let me see if I got this. Surly's challenged the boss to a fight, and when he wins, he'll take over the wrestle zone. Clarice, I take it he's an open to discussion on this. His mind's made up. They're scheduled to fight at seven this evening. In that case... My friend, how would you like to pose as O'Sullivan and take on Surly yourself? No way am I dressing up as old Boney, but... Do it, or you're getting a Scooby smack. <laughs> Come on, Brain. Let's see him. Do I get a say in this? No need to be shy. We all know you have padding underneath that jacket. Ta-da! Oh, sweet mercy. It's not exactly what I'd call a perfect disguise, my friend. For one thing, you don't even have a ponytail. And O'Sullivan's glasses are oval, not rectangular. And if we could get a hat, we wouldn't have to shave your hair. <laughs> okay, everyone stay here. I'll go see what I can find. What, are you kidding? I'm sorry? So far, you've done just about everything in this little adventure. It's high time I took over. I'll get the disguise ready. Are you sure? We also need to get O'Sullivan away from the arena, and I've no idea how we can pull that off. Which is why it's best left to me. Oh, well, okay then. Clarice, cup of tea? Brain, you with me? Oh yeah, baby! I do not want to know how you just did that. Really, I would pay money to learn that trick. Just don't follow me, alright? Follow you? Hey, you're the sidekick. We can now play as Simon and Brain. We are going to have some puzzle fun here. Oh dear, multi-character parts. Ready right. for action. First things first. Brain's the only one who can withstand the horrors that is his own room. So... You can never carry too many socks. We need the sock. I'll clean it up tomorrow. And we've got a variety of places where we can go. Let's see here. First, I'd like to go to the Cosmic Burger, because we've got two things we need to do here. Oh. Sorry, skip that. That looks familiar. It ought to. Hello? Oh, great. Hi, Smiley. Oh, what do you want? What you doing in there? What do you think I'm doing? I'm a fugitive in hiding, and if I'm seen in public, I'll be thrown back in that hellhole of a prison. Now go away before somebody sees me! Oh, if only this was Greece back in the... B.C. era. Where's your dad? That's surly to you, and he's gone to run some errands. He couldn't find anywhere to park, so he left the van here. When you get hungry being in there all day? Actually, now that you mention it, I'm starving. Um, this is a little embarrassing, but could you go and buy me a cosmic kid's meal? What? No way! Please, go get me one and I'll... I'll give you one of my dad's bottles of power juice. Power juice? It's what makes him stronger. Just one sip and he's ready for battle. Well, I don't think it's possible for me to be stronger than I already am, but okay. And we now have a quest. See you later. However, there's something else I want to do here. Oddly enough, if this place actually existed, I would go here just once. Welcome, Cadet. 
debt to Cosmic Burger, where every meal is a galactic adventure. To begin your voyage to the stars, please choose something from our menu. Yeah, this is oh, oddly high budget. Cola for this cool customer, coming right up. Please drop your Earth money into the container, and your meal will be ready momentarily. Thank you. Stand by to be transferred to the lunch pad. Please take your meal and prepare to lunch. That was fun. Seriously, if a 